Hello, hello guys. I am Zachary the Ghost Watcher. I'm back again with another eye-opening movie. And today I want to talk about this film called The Clone Tyrone. If you haven't watched the movie, please go ahead and watch the movie. I'm not going to speak much about it, but I'll just, you know, highlight some of the few things that I saw from this movie that effed me up. I had to pause the movie around 49 minutes and 30 one second because of the way in the church building the preacher man was preaching everybody believed that they are praising god not knowing that behind the church there is a big lab where the scientists are busy cloning people you know i got emotional and i had to pause a bit because i started to realize that you know they are owning the food industry they are owning the hair product industry. They are owning the church industry. They are owning everything. People were in the club and they were hypnotized and they were doing exactly what the DJ was telling them to do. Jimmy Fox, he is the pimp. His name is Slick. John Puyega, he is the drug dealer. They call him Tyrone. But here I am reading his name is... Um, Fontaine, and we also have the prostitute, and she is just amazing. Her name is Yo Yo because of she's always going back and forth, and she's working for the pimp Jimmy Fox. But they're always fighting because of Jimmy Fox is not paying her enough. Jimmy Fox is a struggling pimp, and her real name is Tayona Perez. Now, let me just give you a little bit of the story about, you know, this film, so that when you watch it, you will understand things that you may miss, right? We have a drug dealer, we have a pimp, and we have a prostitute. The three of them, they are working together to expose the government. The government has this project that they are running, whereby they are experimenting and they are um, capturing people from the streets and they are doing some experiments and they are cloning them by making multiple identical people who will be around the world so that there will be a world new order and they can control people. Those who want to go and party who are in the club, they get hypnotized. Those who go to the saloon to go and fix their hair, once they put the hair product in you know, your skull, you start listening to whatever that they're telling you you get controlled those who go to church the preacher men preach you know and just behind the, the church it's a big lab where they are busy you know cloning people now the guy tyrone he's doing his round as he's doing his round you know going to collect money to you know other drug dealers and those who are selling drugs at his corners you know he's disciplining them then he goes to the pimp to go and collect his money because, you know, Jimmy Fox, his name is Slick and he's, you know, a pimp and he's also selling drugs. He collects his money, but Jimmy Fox, he's struggling because of now the ladies of the night, you know, they are not getting much business or savings on the streets because brothers are not buying. He's trying to tell Tyrone that, man, I'm not making enough money. I don't have money, man. You know, you are my childhood friend, you know, but... Tyrone, you know, take the money from Jimmy Fox and he leaves. While he's in his car, there comes another car, parked behind him. They waited for him to open the door only to, you know, start shooting him. He died. Jimmy Fox witnessed that. Yo-Yo, who is, you know, the prostitute, witnessed that. And everybody can, you know, testify that, you know, the biggest drug dealer in the whole world has been shot by other gang members and he died but surprisingly when jimmy fox was just sitting at his place the following morning he was just surprised to see tyrone the guy who was shot yesterday at his doorstep telling him that he's there to collect his money he said man i i don't know what's going on and i don't know if i'm dealing with a ghost because of you were here yesterday you collected your money yesterday you did this and you did that you went to your car and you got shot and you died Everybody saw that. 
So they started arguing because now Tyrone is like saying you're lying. You don't want to pay me. Now Tyrone, he's so angry and Sleek, who is there, telling Tyrone that you know let's go outside because of I saw you talking to Yoyo, the prostitute, before you know you showed up to my building. She can testify. I am not lying to you. And they went down there to speak with the prostitute. And he said, yeah, yesterday you were here, you spoke with me before you go to Slick's place. And you got shot. Everybody can testify that you died. We are surprised to see you. Now they started, you know, doing some research and investigations only to find out that there is a certain house. And in that house, you know, it's a lab. And there are scientists who are busy working and testing all the chemicals and, you know, experimenting with people. Only to find out that there is a chemical that they put in the spice. Now, when they are frying chicken, you know, they are putting that chemical and that makes people laugh and that makes people be controlled. Now, they're like showing you all the fast food industry, how these guys are controlling the fast food industry. And they're showing you when women are going to the saloon so that, you know, their hair can look good, what they do with the hair product. It's the whole operation. And now, when these people finally go to a church, that's when they find out that people are praising God, they're doing all this type of stuff, but there is a big, big, you know, pro, uh, you know production which is going on. You know, the scientists are busy, you know, experimenting with people. They just snatch people from the street, they take them there. But the most painful part was that when Tyrone showed up there, he found out that there are so many Tyrones who are in the lab. They can speak, they can do all the type of stuff. Slick, who is Jimmy Fox, when he got there, he found so many Jimmy Fox or so many Slicks who are pimp, who behave like him, talk like him, who do everything like him, who are also cloned and they are in the lab. Guys, I don't want to give away the whole form. I just wanted to give you the background story. These guys go extra mile so that they can expose, you know, the government, they can expose everything that they're doing, you know, and man. This one, this one was heavy because of around 49 minutes and 31 seconds, I had to pause it. You know, my, my stomach was, you know, my stomach was turning, man. I just got emotional. I had a lot of headaches because of these are the things that we always speak about. And you start realizing that, you know, there is a reason why some other people who are on those top positions, they decided to go vegan because of they know exactly the type of food these guys are giving us and most people they're just saying you know what we are going to go raw vegan very soon whereby people will start planting their own food and eat certain food and avoid this other type of food because of the things that they put in there you know and they're doing all those type of stuff those guys because of they just wanted to they said they wanted to create the warrior order whereby they can just make people obey and follow the rules and oh my god guys just go and watch it you know jimmy fox is also a producer into this film and man rotten tomato gave you know this film 94 percent is the highest the movie is about two hours just go and watch the movie guys and i'll just put some of the screenshot for you guys because I'm still sitting down here and looking at the entire thing. We all saw COVID-19, what happened on COVID-19. You know, they just shut down all the church. Like, they're just showing you that we can shut down the church. There is no church leader who will go against us because of we control everything. We are the one who decide what happened. Guys, without giving away too much on this phone, just watch the movie. And at the end, when Tyrone meets the original Tyrone, who is the old man, and he's saying, I've been watching you over the years. And he explaining the reason why he decided to join the government or the team of scientists whereby they can start experimenting with people. And he's telling him why he gave him certain memories and why he didn't want to give him certain memories. Jimmy Fox was just hypnotized. He didn't even know what to do when he see 
you know, multiple Jimmy Foxes, you know, at the lane. People are partying in the club, but the DJ just play one song. That song hypnotizes everybody. They do what they are told to do. Watch the movie if you have enough, a chance to watch it, guys. It's called The Clone Tyrone. Thank you.